What's going on everybody? Today we are doing the Deoxys V-Star and V-Max box with the Zero Aura and V-Max. You know, these boxes came out uh, last Friday actually, but you know, uh, we, had other, we had other plans, you know. We always have other plans for other videos. But anyway, if you guys haven't opened them, got them yet, you know, you should always check them out. You know, maybe I'll go through what the cards do and stuff like that because I don't even know what they do yet. But anyways, we also have these. Got these at Target. You know, we, uh, they've been coming out with these. I saw that they're coming out with them for, uh, you know, the new set, the next new set too. Uh, Tempest, yeah. Uh, Silver Tempest. So, these things are cool. Uh, I got them. They're, they're going for 25 but for six packs, it's pretty, I think they're 25 in a way. It's pretty good. It's a pretty good deal. When I got them originally, I was like, oh, I thought they were uh, building battles, but apparently not. But I haven't opened them up yet on the channel, so I thought I would just to show you guys, you know, them. So, uh, yeah, anyway, you know, uh, you know, leave a like and subscribe, you know, share out, share out the channel, all that good stuff, all that fun stuff that I really appreciate that helps me grow my channel out so I can do better videos for you and get better equipment and all that other stuff, like apparently a new mic. Uh, but anyways, uh, even a new camera because I'm still running on my iPhone 6. Anyways, you know, enough with the uh, interview uh, and, you know, the introduction thing, you know, uh, let's get this, uh, let's get this party started. You know, we still got a lot of Lost Origin to get to, uh, 36 cards I believe is left it, so, uh, Let's hope we get something new out of that, and uh, hopefully these boxes give us some good luck, all right? All right, everyone, here we go. We, we, we're going to start with the Deoxys. Apparently, I heard this Deoxys has some potential. Not 100% sure on that one, but, you know, unfortunately, these things are for $30. They come with, you know, three promos or whatever with the giant Deoxys box, but only get four packs, so, you know, that's a little something you're going to uh, just be aware of. You don't you only get four packs out of these. You know, there you go. We get, you know... Promo, 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 and four packs, a guide apparently, and an acrylic V Star marker, and a code. So, with these collection boxes, you know, when it comes to something like that, I will not be giving the code out in the video. I will only be giving the code out to two lucky subscribers who, you know, uh, share my video on Twitter or Facebook, whichever one, whichever one you want to do. Um, I would really appreciate that. Anyways, let's get let's get this thing started. We got this V. We got this home, and it's too big for my camera angle. Anyway, we got the Oxus V Star, big giant box, cool, cool, cool. We got lots of plastic, of course. Um, we got the nice little V marker that comes with, like everything now. I'm like, do, you, do people even use those V markers? I mean, you should. But anyway, we got the Deoxys, the Deoxys V Max, and hold on, man, here, and the Deoxys V Star. So let's see what's a big deal about these. I've heard there's some potential with them. I don't know. We got the Deoxys V Star. We got here. This tech does 60 to one of your opponent's bench Vs, so it does a little snipe damage. And this does 60 to each energy for each energy to pull Pokemon. Honestly, I don't see that as too impressive of a card, in my personal opinion. What about the Deoxys V Max? All right. Uh, I do believe this is better. All of your Pokemon take 30 less damage against V Stars, so that's always nice. And then you heal 20 from this Pokemon. It's 160, so very, very weak. Um, I wouldn't play with it, honestly. Um, not very powerful, not very, you know, valuable in my opinion when it comes to that, that stuff. And here's the other Deoxys. Uh, this attack does 30 damage for each energy, and whatever. Yeah, so honestly, I don't see the goodness in Deoxys too hard maybe i'm missing something there on that one but anyways let's get these packs underway we'll see what we got here we got lost origin lost origin ash Radiance, and brilliant stars pretty good wish there was evolving skies but not everything can have evolving skies in it right uh we're gonna just go with brilliant stars first here you know oldest to newest you know all that good jazz anyways guys you know i really hope you guys enjoyed your uh, week you know it's friday and you know we all love fridays right it's the weekend yeah days off um kind of you know even if you guys are kids or something like that you know all that good stuff so happy friday everybody i hope you guys had a really good week we got choice but that's a good start okay we got care less oh a nice little full R aurora's premonition uh, and a manaphy all right that's a good that's a good rare too i, I know it's not i know it's not how you spell her name how, uh, what was it acerola premonition your opponent reveals their hand and draw a card for each trainer card um not too powerful of a card, but it is nice to see your opponent's hand and see what, you know, what's coming on, what's, what's about to happen. So, I don't know, maybe some value in that, you know, uh, based on how you want to play, you know, and all that good jazz, you know. So, here we go. We got ourselves uh, Astro Radiance. All right, Astro Radiance. Haven't seen, oh, Energy Lotto. All right, we got Scythe, Eevee, Teddy Ursa, Mantine, Mighty Enough. We got a hit. 
All right, we got a nice Mighty Inna in the trainer gallery. And, oh, and, and then we got a Heat Tran VMAX. Look at that. Two pack magic, right? You know, two hit and one pack magic there. That's what I meant by that. Anyway, we got a nice little Mighty Inna. The Mighty Inna is worth about a dollar. And we got the Heat Tran VMAX, maybe a dollar fifty. I think this thing has some potential someday. I can't remember. Once during your turn, you may have a, if you have a stay in play, you may heal 50 from this Pokemon. So that's some healing damage with 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 a uh, Magma Basin. Get an energy up, heal it, you know, all that good jazz. And your opponent's Pokemon is Burn, which does two damage counters per upkeep, I believe. And then we're going to just move along here. So not bad of a card. Unfortunately, it's a fire type. And fire types just have a hard time in this meta. There are still Palky out there. I know everything's all focused on this Lost Box decks, you know, but there's still Palky out there. Someone's going to come up with something to beat this Lost Box deck, and it's not going to be fun. Let's just say that. Wurple. Right, Horn. Oh, a nice little Ore Beetle V Max. We got a hit. Nice little Ore Beetle V Max out of the trainer gallery for Lost Origins. And oh, a Hollow Rare. Look at that. Wow, we have gotten hit after hit so far. Every single pack in this box so far has been a uh, hit. Man. Or Beetle VMAX. Very, very nice full art. I do have this in my binder, but can't complain about a VMAX full art. That's very nice. I do believe that card is like a $3 card. Maybe even higher than that. It might be even 5 to 7 I'm not percent sure on that price. Um, but definitely a very nice hit. I'll take it anyways all day. Very nice Or Beetle VMAX. We got the last Lost Origin pack here. We got Lumion and Licky Licky. We got Apom and Kaferi. Slugma. I know today... Look, hold on, let's get through this. Gumi and Stone Journer. All right. We'll go ahead. I'll, I'll talk about what I was going to say after this Zero Aura introduction. We get the Zero Aura box. Very, very nice. Now, this one I do believe is playable. Um, I heard that the Axis had, maybe had a potential. I don't know. I just kind of overheard it a little bit. But I do believe that the Zero Aura has, is playable. Because uh, this thing was kind of hard for me to grab, honestly. Okay, we got ourselves some plastic, lots of plastic. We got some packs. We and we'll build those later. All right, we we probably already know what they are. <laughs> we got ourselves a nice jumbo card, nice jumbo Zero Aura V Star. Very cool. Can't complain. Very 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 cool. I like Zero Aura. Probably one of my favorites of a newer generation. I'm still an old school guy. Like a lot of old stuff. And boom, we just dumped it out. Saving the code card for another lucky subscriber. Okay. We have the Zero Aura. Let's see what we got for playability here. Zero Aura V Star. Uh, you may discard a stadium in play. Not terrible, not bad either. And it's star power ability. Choose one of your opponent's Pokemon. This is this is where it's at right here. Choose one of your opponent's Pokemon four times. So you can choose your opponent's Pokemon. It doesn't have to be the same one. And it says you can choose the same Pokemon more than once. So that means you can do four of them. And each of them do 60 damage to each. Or you can do all of 240 if you want to to one. But the, the reason why that's so good is there are, there's a card called uh, Sableye, you know. Sableye is really, really good. Here is the V for him. Very, very nice. That's cool. That's a very cool artwork. That that That's that's very that's a very cool artwork. I will take that artwork. That is really cool. That's the V for it. And we'll see what the V Max does before I ramble on about the V Star here. Uh, got two thir 320, so this attack does 60 for each of your opponent's Pokemon in play that has an ability. Eh. And this card, two energies from the Pokemon. Eh. Uh, the V-Star, though, is where it's at. Um, Sableye, Lost Engine Boxes, you know, dumping damage counters all over the place, and all of a sudden you can go 60, 60, 60, 60, and just wipe things out. Uh, same pack selection. Okay, I, I, I got confused. Two Lost Origin, Brilliant Stars, and Astro Radiance. Alright. So, here we go. I think, uh, sometimes people, you know, kind of they, they, they start collecting Pokemon cards, you know, stuff like that, because it's kind of popular and what like that, and then people forget that. It's a game, too, and a lot, a lot of the stuff is, it has its value because of its playability. Some of it's because of artwork, don't get me wrong. We got Brilliant Stars. Um, <clears throat> but a lot of a lot of cards' value is because of their playability in the meta, and how relevant they are. Alright, here we go. We got Pachirisu and Blender. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, by the way, t I know today is the ch release of the Charizard. Oh, no, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. We got a Vaporeon. What's up, Vaporeon? This card is worth like a $3 card. And, ooh, Luxray. That code lied to me. It said it was a black code. And it lied to me. But we still got a hit out of the trainer gallery nonetheless. Vaporeon, very, very beautiful. Got Gary back there. I absolutely love those those uh, EVs from the uh, trainer gallery in that set. Very awesome. Very nice card. Now, all, all, 
all those Eevee cards, the Eevee and the three evolutions out of Brilliant Stars Train Gallery, are all are all worth about three or four dollars. They're worth they're worth hit they're worth getting a pull out off of. That's for sure. I'll take those all day long. All right. I mean, I wouldn't I don't need them all all day long, but I would at least take them. You know, it's a good hit. It's a very nice hit. All right. We got Oshawa and Rowlet. Interesting. We got Ralts and Arcanine. All right. What was that? That was Astro Radiance. Oh well, Astro Radiance failed us this time. All right. On to Lost Origins. We got. What, I, I'm guessing the Deoxys box is going to win here because it's saying, I'm not good, but you, I'm going to beat you in a pack battle. All right. We got ourselves a nice energy. We got lots of energy today. Bronze on Litleo. We got Litwick and Snowvert. Rhyhorn. McCargo and Polyrath. I didn't need any of that. All right. And the other Lost Origin pack. I know. Uh, I, I'm excited to do those other Lost Origin boxes. You know, it's going to be it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. We're going to enjoy it. We're going to get some Lost Origin we don't have. It's going to happen, right? We're going to get something cool. Something cool. Aerodactyl. We want the Aerodactyl or the Rotom alternate arts. Those are the most wanted of everything else. Spinarak. And, ooh, nice little Kyurem V. Coming in for the last pack of that box. Very nice. I'll take Kyurem V. This card is worth about $1.50 to $2. It's because the Kyurem deck is pretty good. Uh, the V is not worth nearly as much as the V Max, but it is what it is. And that's how it always is, honestly. But, nonetheless, there's those two boxes. Those are the packs in it, you know. Um, the playability of least Zero Aura is very, very, very possible. Um, you only get one V-Star star ability, so, you know, use it wisely. Anyway, we got these Lost Origins. Six booster packs and a booster. I believe this is either 25 or 30 If it's 25 it's definitely worth it. Even 30 it's like, eh, that's still $5 a pack. Uh, I don't know. But I believe they're 25 I believe they're worth it. So, when I bought these, I'm like, man, that's like $5 more than the Bill and Battle Kit. And then... It's just like a building battle kit. It literally is. You know, open up, boom. Six beautiful packs just laying in there. All right, let's put those aside. I do like those boxes too. When people have like big, big orders from my on my PC player, ones that are like more than like forty cards. So I can fit forty cards in a mini tent, even in a sleeve, in, in even in the uh, thick sleeves that you get in ETBs, I can fit forty cards in a mini tent. But once it gets over forty, it starts getting really, really cramped. So I end up putting them in there and setting them in a little box and making it all nice and tight and and safe in the box, you know, and all that good stuff. I, 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 Fairy and Sojourner, I really, really take pride in my customer service on my store. If somebody has a complaint, I'm more than willing to help them out, you know, give a refund or whatever the case may be. More than willing, all, always, always. So, customer satisfaction is my number one key in my on my store. And I, I, I and even like, I always put things lightly played, even if I just see a little nick. You know, I know it's not like part of the TCG players, you know, code. Hey, Bob Plume and Cramorant. All right. Cramorant, worth about 50 cents. Not terrible. Not a terrible rare. So far, nothing out of this little six-pack box, but that's all right. I wanted to, I wanted to feature these off because I knew I wasn't going to be able to feature them in the rest of my uh, Lost Origin videos. You know, uh... Next week, next week, you know, on Monday is Halloween, so you, I bet you know what's going to happen on Halloween. I bet you can kind of guess what I'm going to open up on Halloween because I haven't opened them up yet. We'll just say that, all right? I bet you know that. Hey, we got a cook. We got a full art cook. You know, this crazy thing is this is a new card, and, oh, Pyroar. And I was thinking, watch, I'm not going to get this cook because you know what? I never pulled the cook out of Astro, uh, is it Astro Rain? No, Brilliant Stars. I never pulled the other cook out of Brilliant Stars, even though it's only like a $2 card at that. Even this one's like $2, but I never pulled it. Now we got it out of Lost Origin, and that is another new card. And we are down to 35 cards missing. And I think only like three cards in the, in the trainer gallery missing. We just missed the Pikachu V, the boss's orders, and the Pikachu V Max gold. That's all we're missing. That's, that, that's crazy. But anyway, we're getting somewhere. Yeah, I mean, I was wondering why I'm not doing well on Reverse Hollows. I think I kind of realized it. Shop it and... Uh, Snorlax. I need that reverse Snorlax. I know that for a fact. Why do I put that Snorlax in the regular cards? There we go. You, you go over here in a nice little pile so I can put you in a sleeve later. Yeah, so I do put all of my cards in sleeves. At least all the shinies. I don't, obviously, that'd be a lot of sleeves if I did all the commons and uncommons too. Um, but yeah, I do sell my, my stuff in bulk also. So if you're from my area and you know who I am, you know, you can always contact me if you. Hey, we got ourselves a nice Parasect. And, ooh, Dustox. You can always contact me if there's some reverse hollows you're missing out of your sets and all that good jazz. Anyway, got Parasect. About a dollar. About a dollar. Trainer Gallery. All right. We got one more pack out of this uh, 
little box here. So we're doing good. We're not, not spending too much time, which is exactly how I like it. We got a nice little nice code card for you. We're on our last pack of this box, and we got one more box of six packs. And then we're done. We all done. We had fun today. We're going. We're, it's fun, you know. It's Halloween weekend. It's Halloween. Everybody, be safe. Hey, we got a nice little radiant Steelix. All right, very very nice. And oh, nice. Look at that. Look at that. We got Kieran. Look how badly cut it is. First of all, look at that. We got two hits in one pack. Again, very very nice. Um, radiant Steelix about fifty cents in this guy here. About man, how bad it's cut. Uh, it doesn't have the the dots in it, so it's not super terrible on the back. But man, the top is it's still. Dollar fifty, unfortunately. So dollar fifty. All right, next box. We got ourselves and I love these boxes, by the way. I just do. I like how they. And yeah, I'm, I'm excited to see these for Silver Tempest too. I wouldn't mind buying a case of these. What would you think? Would you guys watch me open a case of these too? It'd be kind of interesting. Let me leave a comment on that. You know, if, if you look at all this Giratina. What's with the pack selection? Look at the pack arts. Why? Why? <laughs> all right. Apparently, it wanted Giratina and Zorb. Maybe it was kind of reminiscing on these sleep pack openings that we did for the back-to-back -back weeks. Not bad. Last week's Wednesday video, a lot better than this week's, but we still got some cards we didn't have this week. So, we are trucking along. Absolutely trucking along. And if you guys watched Wednesday video, that, that full art Fantina that I pulled, that was a new card, by the way. So, that was added on there. Hey, we got a nice little Spirit Tomb. Very, very nice. Trainer Gallery. And, oh, a nice Gudra V-Star. Man, those Gudras are easy to pull. Man, pull those things all the time, I swear. Anyway, Spirit Tomb, five dollar. Gudra V Star, about two dollars. You know, we just racking up them dollar bills. Dollar dollar bill, y'all. Look at all those hits, though. Not bad. Not bad for kind of a smaller video. I mean, dang, I'm up. we got twelve and eight. We got twenty packs total. Not bad. That's a lot of hits for twenty packs, and we're not even done yet. We're not even. We still got five packs to go. We'll get some four more. So really, really nice. All right, we got ourselves an Ink. We got Jinx, Makiana, Gumi, and Buffalant. Buffalant. All right, all right, Giratina. Come on now. We, 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 what's the big Buffalant? Okay. We all. <laughs> yeah, I think we've been spoiled by all these hits today. This is very, very nice. And I am ready for next week. Um, you know what the ones. You know what Monday's video will be. You know what it is. It's Halloween. And you know. You know what that video is gonna be. Wednesday's video is going to be the booster box versus the sleeve packs of 36 and 36, so 72 packs total out of Lost Origin. Going to be crazy. And then uh, Inke and Eridos. And then uh, Friday will be the Charizard Ultra Premium Collection box, as long as I can get it by then. It comes out, you know, came out obviously today, but... Um, I heard they're kind of on back order, but I've also pre-ordered two of them, so <laughs> I'm like, I better get one at least. I pre-ordered two of them, one to open it up for you guys, so you can see what's in it, and one to keep sealed. We got Pikachu, Cascoon, and, Cas and a Dugong. All right, two more packs, everybody. About that time for me to say it, you know. Hey, you know, if you like what you see, you know, enjoy some nice little company, you know, a nice little fun, little energetic opening, you know, you know. Hit that like and subscribe, you know, come join the channel. Hit that notification bell too, so you can possibly get some of these code cards. I know there's I know there's like people who snipe them with bots and all that stuff. Anyway, but yeah, come see them. Come and try and gather them at least, you know. I mean <laughs> I'd appreciate if you just watch my video anyway. Because just enjoy, just have a nice good time. We have a nice good comfy time trying to complete binders and make big openings, and we do a lot of big openings. I really need to uh I wanted to keep doing more and more videos, you know, more and more big openings. So, as long as you guys can keep on, you know, hitting that subscribe button and keep liking it and sharing out my video and getting me the views and getting me the subscriber counts. And that's what it's going to take for us to uh, get this channel rolling even better. And I can't wait to be monetized. I would love to do, like, vintage stuff. Hey, Harry, I'm an ant trevident for the final card. All right. Not bad at all. Hollow rare goodness. We got all those hits. As soon as I said something, we didn't get another hit. That's kind of a kind of how it goes. But not bad. We I know we at least got one new card. We got one new card. Everything else I know I have. But one new card in uh in, in Lost Origin. That's why we did those. We did those. So very nice. All right. Very very comfortable video. Nice little like you know twenty minute video or so. You know I really appreciate it. You know if you guys stuck around and watched the whole thing. You know go ahead and like like and subscribe. Share it out. And like I said, if you do, like, share it out on Twitter, Facebook, whatever. Um, I'll, I'll send you 10 free codes. Um, also, yeah, just contact me on my email as well. You know, uh, 
you know, uh, go ahead and leave a comment as well. Um, thank you guys so much. I appreciate all of them support. Let's keep growing as a family. Keep growing this thing bigger and bigger. The videos are going to get better. More equipment. All that good stuff eventually. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all of the support. And I'll see you guys on Halloween.